Eyelid tumors are tumors that occur on the skin of the eyelids, and orbital tumors are tumors that occur deeper uh, in the what's called the orbit, that's the tissue surrounding the eye. Okay, the symptoms of orbital tumors include bulging the eye, displacement of the eye, sometimes double vision, occasionally loss of vision, pain can be one of the symptoms, and swelling of the, of the tissues around the eye, the eyelids. The symptoms of eyelid tumors include a growth on the eyelid, discoloration of the eyelid, a swelling, uh, painless uh, growth of uh, a new lesion, um, sometimes drooping of the eyelid can occur if the, if the tumor is, is heavy enough, uh, loss of eyelashes, and um, rarely pain. The treatment of eyelid tumors depends on whether or not the tumor is, is benign or malignant appearing. Uh, benign tumors are usually treated uh, as needed with excision if the tumor is bothersome to the patient, if it's creating um, ptosis of the eyelid, that's drooping of the eyelid, interfering with vision, or just an unsightly appearance. Malignant tumors are, are definitely much more important to treat because they can grow to be a large size and they can spread and cause a lot of problems. So usually when we have a malignant tumor of the eyelid, we try to remove the tumor completely. And that's done either by excising the tumor and then taking frozen sections of the surrounding tissue to be sure the tumor is completely gone or working in conjunction with a Mohs surgeon, and that's a dermatologist who kind of does that same type of technique, removes a primary tumor, and then takes small slivers of the surrounding tissue to be sure that the margins of the uh, tissue are completely clear of tumor. After we're sure, sure the tumor is completely gone, we reconstruct the eyelid using a lot of different reconstructive techniques. With benign tumors, we usually just treat them kind of as needed if the patient's symptomatic from the appearance of the tumor or with the, the weight of the tumor on the eyelid. Orbital tumors are usually treated with surgery if they need to be treated. You can have benign tumors and malignant tumors. The common benign tumors are vascular tumors, that is tumors composed of blood vessels, and some of the common names are things like cavernous hemangioma, lymphangioma. Cavernous hemangiomas are usually treated when they become symptomatic, when they create enough bulging of the eye or displacement of the eye or loss of vision that they're bothersome to the patient. And we do what's called an orbitotomy where we actually open the tissues behind the eye and remove the tumor. We can sometimes do that just through the uh, tissues on the surface of the eye. Sometimes we have to remove this bone on the outside rim of the orbit, go behind the eye, dissect out the tumor carefully, and then replace the bone. We usually try to do that through an eyelid crease incision so there's no noticeable scar.